can contact him because what is he trying to do? He's just trying to say, hey, I'm playing by the rules. The camera's out there. It's been tagged. Please don't mess with my stuff. Like, mm. Just leave it alone. Don't steal it. Don't destroy it. It's not out there to find some girl and their dog in the a mile back in the swamp. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's to track whitetails. This guy, you know, he painstakingly went out there and probably has a, a few cameras running. And this might be a major trail that feeds off into a bedding area that he likes. And he only hunts it maybe one time a year. Or maybe hunts it every weekend. Maybe he's a weekend where Whatever it may be. Mm-hmm. Uh, he's got every right to run that camera. And... I mean, I don't know about most guys, but I see a camera. I want to check out the area. No one's going to go through the trouble of putting a camera in an area if they don't think that deer are there or it won't at least be there for a long time. So I know where the camera is. I scout the whole area out. If I find a tree stand, I know that's been preoccupied by another hunter. But if I don't, that's going to be a spot I'm going to start to look for sign. It's I'm going to look for trails that go off of that. I'm going to try to see if I can cut those deer off to that spot either direction because like literally it's nothing it's no different than finding a big buck rup and when you're on public uh, public land like that and if 